Today, let's go head to head with two of the biggest players in the automation space, Zapier and Workado. So collectively, they serve millions of companies worldwide. So it is a really good idea to get to know what makes them unique. So today we're gonna to talk about what these platforms actually are, how they're similar, and what makes them different. So let's do this. Zapier and Workado are technically what's called an integration platform as a service, or iPaaS for short. Essentially what these tools help you do is automate your work by connecting your business tools together. So as an example, imagine a lead submits a form on your website. When that happens, you might wanna automatically send them an email in Gmail. This is exactly the type of thing that Zapier and Workado help with and make super easy. While Zapier and Workado have many differences, they're actually built on really similar core concepts. So quickly, let's cover what these core concepts are and exactly what Zapier and Workado call these things. Zapier and Workado both let you build workflows that automate your work. In Zapier, this is called a Zap. In Workado, this is called a recipe, but under the hood, it's basically the same thing. In a Zap, there's a trigger that triggers a set of actions that take actions in your apps. In Workado Recipes, a trigger will similarly trigger a set of actions that take actions in your apps as well. These workflows are able to function in Zapier and Workado because each of these tools have built integrations with apps that you can automate. In Zapier, this is called an app. In Workado, this is called a connector. But again, the core concept is exactly the same. Now that you're familiar with the key concepts, let's talk a little bit about how Zapier and Workado are different. So to get a sense of what's different between these tools, let's talk about the areas that each shine. So starting with Zapier, let's talk about the three areas that Zapier is really, really strong. First is pricing. So the most glaring difference between Zapier and Workado is the price. Zapier starts at literally free and scales up in a really nice way where you have $29 plans, $200 plans, pretty much anything you want, all the way up to $4,000 a month before you would even have to talk to a salesperson. Workado, on the other hand, isn't self-serve and doesn't have transparent pricing. In general, you can assume that Workado is going to start somewhere around $1,000 a month and can easily scale up into multiple thousands or even tens of thousands, depending on your company size. The next area where Zapier really shines is in its ease of use. So Zapier is built to support that self-serve model, and it's meant to be really accessible for pretty much anyone. So throughout all of Zapier, you'll notice very human readable wording, things like apps to talk about their integrations. And in general, it is clearly designed for non-technical users. Recently, Zapier's actually even invested into building AI features that let you type out the type of integration you want to build, and it will automatically build it for you. Now, Workado isn't exactly hard to use. It's meant to be accessible to non-technical people as well but they don't really care about being accessible to everyone in the same way that Zapier is because it's a sales-led motion. And so they can target a more technical or developer-focused class of user and the product is designed to so. So you'll see things like connectors and transactions and ELT mentioned in the product. Again, not necessarily a bad thing if you're a developer, but broadly speaking, it's not as generally applicable or usable as Zapier. Finally, the other big area where Zapier comes out on top is in integration breadth. So Zapier is the king of integrations with over 7,000 different apps that you can use in their platform. This is pretty crazy. Workado isn't exactly a schlump in this area. They have 1,200 integrations. Pretty much whatever you need is there, uh, but it just doesn't compare to the crazy number that Zapier has. All right, we've talked a lot about where Zapier shines. Let's talk about three main areas where Workado really comes through. So first is around enterprise features. Now this is kind of a catch-all, but what this is describing is that Workado has focused their roadmap on catering towards large companies. So things like fine-grained permissions or role-based access control, things that don't really matter if you're a small team of two or three people, is where Workado is really, really great. They also have things like version control, so if you are building a Workado recipe and you decide you wanna roll it back because you found a bug, that's really easy to do. Now Zapier has some of this functionality as well. They've really leaned into it and built it out over the last few years, but it is core to Workado and how the product works. Next, let's talk about reliability features. So Zapier is a very reliable tool, but automations by their nature break. 
when you're connecting lots of different data across different apps, it is bound to not always do exactly what you want. And so Ricardo has built a set of features to make this a little bit more manageable. As an example, if you're working with bulk or large amounts of data, you can actually have Workato sync that or transfer that in a bulk manner as opposed to just individually automating one record at a time. Workato also can handle events that happen when you turn a recipe off. So if you turn a Workato recipe or a Zapier Zap off, in general, it will miss any updates that have happened and the automation won't run. Workato keeps track of that and will actually send those events later as necessary to make sure that you don't miss any of the data that should be flown. And finally, Workato really shines when it comes to enterprise connectors. So we talked a little bit before about how Zapier has 7,000 integrations, and that is definitely true. But Workato has spent a lot of time making sure that the big ones, the Salesforces, the SAPs, their Marketos, the ServiceNows, these enterprise type tools have really deep integrations within Workato. Zapier has integrations for these tools. It's not that you can't use Zapier when it comes to enterprise apps, um, but Workato has really just spent the time to make sure that their offerings there are really solid. Now that you understand the differences between Zapier and Workato, let's just talk a little bit about who these tools are meant for. So broadly speaking, these are horizontal platforms. Automation is used by pretty much any function in a modern business. And so there isn't a single person that these tools are targeting. That being said, it seems to be very popular with RevOps teams, sales teams, and marketing teams, as well as founder types, right? People that essentially are connecting and integrating, automating their work. So when it comes to the function, Zapier and Workato actually serve a fairly similar persona with again, Workato leaning towards the slightly more technical developer IT persona and Zapier a little bit more into the non-technical operator persona. The bigger difference really comes down to company size. So Zapier, as we talked about before, is really amazing when it comes to their pricing and they target SMBs and startups. Over the last few years, they've started to target enterprises more, but the way that they were built from the beginning was to cater towards those small startups. Workato went the opposite route they, from the very beginning, have been targeting bigger companies. So think at least 100 people, often 500,000 or more. And that's where all those features we talked about earlier really come in handy. So to wrap it up, Zapier and Workato are both fantastic automation tools. If you're a startup or an SMB, Zapier is probably the way to go. If you're a bigger company or an enterprise, you might want to check out Workato. And if you're looking to more deeply integrate your tools, think things like two-way sync, check out WhaleSync, that's us. We specialize in these deep two-way sync integrations that go beyond what a Zapier or Workato can offer.